Right, so just going to show you the nulling of the EEPROM key. Now this will be part of the next update of my Xbox sophomoring tool. So I'll load into config magic and show you the current key. So as you can see the key, the hard drive is locked. Load into NK patcher settings. Go to EEPROM, Advanced Features, HDD key, and now the HDD key. Now, I explain what it does. Also, the fact that there's a master password applied to the drive. Now, not all drives support the master password, and if it doesn't, then you need the EEPROM, or if the process is successful, then you don't need an EEPROM. The LED status because it's a headless application so the screen will go black or if you're running in SD resolutions you will get the Xbox soft modding tool loading screen until it's finished and also there is a chance a rare very rare chance that your drive could corrupt and it becomes non-usable now this can happen with any software if you lock it via the PC config magic chimp anything that can happen as well it just seems after so many unlocks relocks the drive gives up um, I've had two original Xbox drives do this uh, one locked via config magic and one locked via chimp and both of them became useless but they were only 8 gigabyte drives so no loss but the choice is there uh, you get the chance to back out but in this case I'm just going to show you So what will happen is you'll get a black screen or the loading image will be there. The LED on the front of the Xbox will be red and then it will turn green. It will then flash orange and then it will flash green and then turn red again and reload into NK patcher settings. That's the process done now. So that's your hard drive now locked to a nulled key and your EEPROM on this Xbox has been updated with a nulled key as well. I'll just quickly show you the... after I do the backup and stuff like that. back uh, re back up the files but this time now with the updated information as you can see so your hard drive key is now all zeros you can also check that the drive is locked turn the Xbox on and off And that's you. So that's how the process is to know your hard drive key when using my Xbox soft mode until now. This update isn't out as of this video. Uh, once I test it more and get a few more people to test it, I'll release it. Um, one thing to note, after the update, if you were using 480p or higher, the EEPROM is reset so you need to go back into settings but they'll display mode just turn it on and off and that will re-enable 480p or 720 to whatever you were using as you can see 
<coughs> excuse me, as you can see. So yeah, that's that.